Hai, Assalamualaikum Salam sejahtera hmm, Today we will cover about the wind turbine on the calculation part uh, we already learn on introduction a little bit on introduction what is, uh, what is uh, wind turbine uh, the bleed that can draw energy yes uh, use uh, wind to rotate uh, a little bit like that okay but today today uh, we will cover on the calculation part we will cover on the calculation part uh, basically on the wind turbine cal calculation part there is only one there is only one formula okay if you look at uh, if you look at my slide in the previous session uh, you can see there is only one there is two sorry there is two uh, formula but most of them now uh, we will use most of the calculation part we will use uh, the long part where p viable or p win equal to uh, rho times a times uh, velocity power 3 divided by 2 and uh, time the efficiency of the generator or the turbine okay but today we have we will have uh, two example the first example uh, a sound like this suppose you have a micro turbine with bleed diameter of 1 meter with the efficiency of 20% so uh, the bleed diameter is 1 meter uh, and the bleed also the bleed uh, sorry let me find uh, slide show wait for a moment uh, design I think is slide show Animation, not animation, view. I think it's in draw. Okay. This is your blade. Okay, this is your blade. Sorry. Zach. This is your blade. Ticker. This is your blade okay what is uh, it say that the blade diameter this is your your diameter of your blade okay from here to here is one meter so you have a uh, each blade you have one meter radius uh, sorry 0 0.5 meter radius so the blade also has a 20 percent of efficiency so the question asks you to calculate how much electricity uh, it can generate for your home at the air speed of 6 meter per second. Calculate how much electricity if your uh, turbine has a 1 meter diameter and the blade of your turbine or micro turbine has a efficiency of 20%. Okay. So the solution is the solution is you have to calculate the rotor sweat area first. The rotor sweat area first. Where is the rotor sweat area? Let me draw for you so that you can see. For example, this is your micro turbine. This is your micro turbine. So the rotor sweat area is here. The rotor sweat area is here. So you have to find that area first. So uh, you can use this formula by r squared uh, it is similar like this because d equal to r uh, sorry uh, is, is good uh, d divided by 2 equal to r right so if you want to put r inside there so you have to replace the d also we have to replace the R uh, with the component uh, so you can have the formula that you always use right divided by 4 so you can have the rotor sweat area by using a simply a formula this is uh, from your 
ke tempat saya rasa kan ke tempat kita ke tempat tiga saya rasa ni ter, uh, this is very easy then you can apply the formula of the power of viable from the wind self from the wind itself power of viable uh, so you can use this formula let me choose the eraser part delete this It is so this is the formula that I'm talking about the long formula power of the wind here power of the wind times rho of the uh, air or density of the air here the swept area of your auto this is the swept area of your auto here again and the V the velocity of the air and divide by 2 also not forgotten with the power of tree so you have to multiply density of air here I'm using 1.2 actually uh, the, the density of air is at zero uh, uh, altitude is 1.22 1.225 kilogram per meter cube density kan density power betul lah ok so you multiply everything 1.2 times 0.785 where it come from from here and 6 6 is your speed in meter per second power of 3 and divide by 2 and you got 101.7 watt ok then the power that can be exerted at that speed is from your turbine itself turbine you dia punya blade dia tu ada efficiency uh, efficiency kat soalan ni ialah 20% lah kat sini 20% so you just multiply 20% 20% times benda ni so you got your power available lah power available or power you can extract it from turbine Uh, from your turbine because uh, your bleed hanya boleh cater around 20% saja uh, of the whole powerful wind kalau uh, ikutkan wind tu dihasilkan lebih kurang 107 watt ok 101.7 watt 101.7 watt udara yang 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 ada pada 6 meter per saat tu ok udara yang ada pada 6 meter per saat dan blade diameter 1 meter sepatutnya uh, awak punya wind turbine can extract around 101.7 watt tetapi because of the design uh, the floor tak semua uh, design boleh cater 100% so untuk this case uh, blade tu dia punya efficiency dia cuma 20% saja maksudnya dia boleh cater uh, 20% of uh, watt available in dekat udara kenapa tak ada wah oh, available kat sini je 101 101.7 watt yang available so uh, dia kena times 20% lah so uh, untuk turbine tu baru boleh dapat ok easy saya rasa easy soalan ni mudah dan soalan yang macam ni lah uh, quiz akan ditanya Uh, soalan uh, test susah, sus susah sikit lah ok soalan 2 example number 2 the sound of the example number 2 is like this the average velocity of the wind in the farm indicated at 3.1 meter per second so you can list down the important part here V is 3.1 meter per second and the blade efficiency goes up to 40% ok blade efficiency efficiency of the blade uh, or T is depend on you so right here um, 0.4% <coughs> of the total wind power calculate the radius Sorry. Calculate the radius of the wind turbine blade if 
the power required to run water pump is 100 sorry is 1200 watt okay power needed is uh, 1200 watt so you have to write the formula <coughs> p times uh, equal to rho times a times v velocity power of 3 divided by 2 times uh, efficiency of blade right kalau ada generator you boleh tambah efficiency of generator tapi kat sini kita tak ada generator so kita just leave it there sajalah cukup so uh, soalan dia nak cari soalan dia nak cari find find calculate the radius radius of the wind turbine radius tadi kat sini so, dibagi diameter blade kat sini soalan dia nak minta radius of the turbine so this is basically mathematics simple mathematics you just rearrange back a equal to to p divided by rho v power 3 all whole load at the top just bring down and b right uh, yes is it can okay, and let me write back again a to p rho v power 3 efficiency of the blade so a a we know that a equal to pi r square tak nampak so you can find r equal to square root to p pi rho v that's it you can find the radius in meter how easy is that how easy is that so easy right uh, the more trick that can uh, the, the the question can uh, can tell you the more trick can tell you because the first question the first question, uh, the, uh, the question asks you to find how much the power of one turbine can produce when uh, the question gives you the diameter, the efficiency and the speed. And for the second question, uh, the question asks you to find the radius. So the power is given, the density uh, well known 1.22. Uh, the velocity given here 3.1 meter per second and the efficiency of the bleed 40% just put it everything you can have uh, exactly what is the R the radius in meter okay so the trick uh, the further trick and that the question can ask you or can 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 uh, blind you to answer it correctly it is from here maybe the question give it you in 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 kilowatt hour for example kilowatt hour kilowatt hour so how you uh, you translate from uh, kilowatt hour to what you have you must have uh, some uh, very good knowledge on how to convert kilowatt hour to watt it is easy right it is simple mathematics so i shouldn't uh, teach you how but you may you may flip your books your mathematics books how to uh, to correct this unit kilowatt hour to watt it's easy of course there is a lot of uh, information uh, given a little bit 
because hour here you need uh, operational hour kalau kat sini kalau dia bagi tahu uh, dia operate dalam 320 jam untuk sebulan uh, so dia punya kilowatt hour dia ni awak kena pandai kira lah nak jadikan dia watt ok as simple as that uh, Uh, that's it I think that's it that's it our uh, our calculation part it is very simple one uh, you can find it here what is the answer I didn't give you so you may try yourself if I give it to you everyone will just sit back and relax uh, and and kalau ada quiz ataupun test ha, baru nak try tekan kalkulator kan itu pun kalau yang rajin dia dah buat dahulu lah kalau yang tak rajin tu dia tanya je berapa jawapan dia so saya memang tak tulis untuk solution uh, untuk untuk answer dia kat sini dan dia sangat senang everyone should know how to calculate it just press your calculator let me repeat where's the R What is the R? R is the radius of your bleed. Uh, P is the power in watt. Not kilowatt, but watt. Watt. Uh, pi. The value is 3.14. The density is 1.225. The velocity given 3.1 uh, The blade efficiency is 0.4 with, with the square root You can have uh, Not Maybe maybe the answer is in In For example 8.2 meter for example So you may have a round Number of that But not 1.8 meter lah kalau 8 meter dah you tak boleh produce 1200 watt lah dia mesti above 9 meter ke 8.5 ke it is kind of round out lah walaupun 8.5 kalau you dapat 8.2347 janganlah macam tu kan mana ada orang buat design satu benda dia punya dimension dia sampai ada 10 unit tak betul lah so you you, you, you kena understand tu kalau orang nak nak, nak manufacture Suatu barang Dia kalau boleh nak Macam ni pen, pen ni Pen ni Dia tak nak Dia tak nak kira Orang tak nak manufacture dia aa, Contoh panjang dia ialah 5.2341.7 cm Tak nak macam tu Dia mesti nak 5.5 5.6 Okay Mestilah ada logical Logical sikit lah kalau awak percaya, kalau awak tak percaya, awak ukur semua barang-barang yang ada kat sekeliling awak, dia mesti ada nombor macam tu. 5.6, 5.7, dia tak ada nombor. Panjang dia tu 5.7324, tak ada. Okay. That's it. That's it. Uh, thank you. Thank you for your time. This is very short. Hope you can have your night and have a good sleep. Thank you.